Hi, Richard. Hello. So we have your new book here in front of us, and this book talks about your journey from being rich, basically, um, living in a waterfront home, to losing it all um, and finding your way again. So how does one be so rich and then lose everything and end up on the streets? Well, first of all, I have to say I never believed I'd be on the streets. If you asked me when I was 50 years old, would I be homeless, I'd say no. And I learned that it can happen to anyone. I had a successful business. But times change as they often do in business. The internet boom, if you will, or bust, affected my business quite a bit. I lost many of the people that were supporting what I was doing. And I lost it all. Uh, soon depressed, soon drinking too much, trying to find a way to uh, uh, just cover that all up. And that's, that's how I got there. Okay, and then while you were on the streets, you started writing kind of in a journal format um, about experiences you had, people you met, and now it's all wrapped up in this one book um, for you to share with people. So what would you like to, what message would you like to send to anybody who picks up this book and reads it? How every person reads this book, you know, including anyone that's watching this, because I believe it puts a face on homelessness. It makes those people that you walk by on the street real, because they are. Right. And it's important to know that anyone can be on the street. And to help, through the reading of the book itself, for people to volunteer and to become involved and help the Salvation Army or any organization to indeed right. solve that. Now, so we, we've heard about a little bit about your life when you were rich. We know that you were on the streets. How's Richard Lemieux's life now? Well, I, I live in a small apartment with my wonderful dog, Willow, who lived with me when I was on my streets and, and saved my life. And, and uh, So, the book is doing wonders. It's for the community that I'm in, and, and there's already, they, many people have read the manuscript and love it. Uh, it's a humbling experience, uh, and I'm, I'm doing fine. And, okay. And, and the book, while I do believe, help people. Great, thank you.